It is a party. We are getting started. Inhale. Positivity. <sighs> Exhale. Negativity. Yay. I'm going to be tagging some of our friends here because I just cannot wait to get this party started. You know what? Our Saturday shredders have a special energy to them. You're right where you need to be in your wellness program. You're right where you need to be in your VIP power and progress. And today's theme is speak your success. I want you to speak your success. Well, good morning. Hello there. Just tagging a couple of our beautiful VIPs. I want you to speak your success into existence. Use your words. Use your, your mouth. It's a powerful tool of transformation of manifesting exactly what you want oh you're gonna love this jolt today all right we're gonna get going in 10 seconds so grab your notes if you want to or get on your air stepper with me or do a couple of reps let's get this party started i love our saturday shredders because a lot of people just sleep in and then kind of like the day is just like blah but when you wake up and get this day going and you are jolted Oh boy, it just transforms the entire day and then you get so much done. So hello there. There's a party coming through this portal and I'm going to be talking about how to use your mouth as a transformational tool. And look at this delicious water. I'm so grateful for my clean detox water. Mmm. Mm. Woo! All right, queens, let's go. So I'm gonna get on my air stepper because I love it. I'm gonna get my pump on. All right, let's go. Okay, the power of words. I want you to use your mouth. Your words are your magic boop, wand. Boopity, boopity, boop, bop. Okay, whatever you talk about, you bring about. And on the contrary, whatever you talk about, you bring in your life like drama. That's why I don't engage in gossip at all. I don't get into that tangled web of gossip, he said, she said, negativity. My time is too precious. I'm using it to manifest, to create, to praise it up and not knock other people down. That's been a big cornerstone success to my life, to my coaching. And also that's a VIP woman. We don't have time to gossip, right? So here's a tip. When someone tries to bring you in all that negativity, run. Flip it, change the topic, okay? And I love this positive affirmation. I am better and better with every thought I think, with every word I speak, everything I do, every day in every way. Woo! There's like this really cool metaphysical principle that your word is your wand. Your speech has a powerful effect upon your life in fact, creating your own reality in life. It's so smart to affirm what is going good in your life, what you're proud of, what you are loving about your life. That's why I always say, think about what you have to be grateful for and then talk it. I'm grateful for my hot running water. I'm grateful for this air stepper. I'm grateful for this social media platform where we can connect and empower each other, right? Oh boy, this is good. We must remind ourselves that our words are prophecies that we will fulfill. So right now say, I am strong, I am healthy, I am happy. A great teacher once said, it is done unto you as you believe. So thus by what you talk about, you bring about. That's why as a transformational coach, when I'm doing my coaching consultations, I don't spend a lot of time on the past. I don't spend a lot of time mulling it over what happened to you 10 years ago. I talk about what are you gonna do in the future? Let's look 10 steps ahead. Let's plan our success. So you change and shift your reference point of your memories. You actually have good things to look at. Oh, look at all my workouts I did. Oh my God, I didn't engage in that negative self-talk. I didn't engage in that gossip. I used my time wisely. I wasn't idle. I wasn't just wasting my time. I, I love my new life. We reposition you, recalibrate you for success. Good morning, Valerie. Good morning, Gloria. Good morning, Dynamite. Donna. Hello, Natalie. Love you, love you, love you. Um, speaking your word. Beautiful words, speech, positive affirmations is such an important tool in personal development. Yes, you can. Those three words. Yes, you can. 
that is just a, I mean, that's a powerful positive affirmation. That's why I always say that. And people say, oh, my back hurts. Oh, I'm too old. Oh, I'm achy. Oh, I don't feel good. What kind of affirmations are those? You know, instead of complaining about it, do something proactive, right? Um, being mindful of our speech can have a wonderful effect on all our relationships um, in our life, especially with ourselves, okay? Let no bad words come from your mouth and you're gonna see an amazing transformation of your life. Changing our speech patterns can be hard even when we develop bad habits of speech. So I'm here to tell you that we're gonna do some great exercises today for your mouth because it all starts with your mind. And think about this, even if you don't say the words, it's almost like you did say them because you thought them. So right now, every thought is a prayer. People say, oh, I pray. Well, good for you. We all pray all the time because it's your thoughts. Your thoughts become things. So you have to get a hold of your brain and always thinking positive. Catch it, catch it, catch it. Wow, okay, I gotta get off this thing. Hold on, let me take a big inhale. I get so excited, okay. Um, the term affirmation, we're gonna be doing a ton of positive affirmations during today's workout. Because when you're in a heightened state, in a heightened peak, and your heart is racing, adrenaline rushing, your dopamine is surging, and what you say, that's why I do the power coaching, it stays in your memory. That's why a lot of you say, oh, throughout the day, Coach Janelle is right here on my shoulder. She's in my head. She says, yes, I can. She says, never give up. She says, believe. Because when you've been in this heightened state and you hear these positive affirmations, it sticks to you. It's like shh, branding cattle. It's like shh, on your brain, on your subconscious. That's why you are all having results and they're sticking. And you're looking forward to the next workout, okay? Um, right now, some say that the act of affirming is an act of faith. I believe that. Because if you say, I don't know how, you know, come hell or high water, I'm going to get this done, and you do, that is an affirmation. That is an act of faith. When creating affirmations, think positively, creatively, and learn to do this, you know, even in the midst of challenges, right? You've got to kind of take every moment and shift it to the greater good. Um, I love this one. Proverbs 15, 1 says, A gentle answer turns away wrath, but harsh words stir up anger. So don't be trying to be like coming back and coming back to somebody. It's like dancing with the devil, I say. You know, it's going to exhaust you. I don't care how smart and how great and eloquent your comeback is. You're still wasting your time. And just be like, you know what? I'm going to let go and let God. I like this one as well. Proverbs 18, 4. A person's words can be a life-giving water. Words of true wisdom are as refreshing as a bubbling brook. Woo! I want you to come to these workouts and feel refreshed, rejuvenated, recharged. Isn't that what it's all about? Not exhausted and depleted. Sometimes I see other coaches and they're like berating and, and talking negatively to their clients saying, you lazy, do this, you that. What kind of coaching is that? You want to leave feeling like you've had life-giving water. Words of true wisdom are as refreshing as a bubbling brook. Oh my goodness, I love that. Proverbs eleven seventeen. those who are kind benefit themselves. So when you're kind, yeah, it's good for other people, but it's really for yourself, for your inner peace. And, and also the cruel bring ruins on themselves. So be positive, speak positive words, okay? Because you are a, wait for it, V I P okay so we're gonna have a great workout I want you to get your shoes on your detox water ready we got our mindset right when you talk about it and you send out this positive energy that brings back beautiful blessings to you of abundance health wealth and happiness and you are all doing amazing thank you Laura Jacobo Kathy Bonnie Gloria I'm so grateful for all of you. Thank you so much, Fit Scott. Yes, 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 yes. Right now, if you're not a member, join at jnlvip.com. I love what I do. I love transforming lives and I love our workouts because we get crazy results. I'm serious. It's like an unfair advantage. I've cracked the code of weaving in the cardio blast with the strength training. I got some new moves today and you're gonna absolutely love them. And yeah, we're gonna bring maybe 30 seconds or so in of those resurrection burpees. I know you can do it. 
All right, I'll see you at 8 a.m. Join if you're not a member of jnovip.com. Let's do this. Love you. Ah, it's a party. Thank you, Yaya. Thank you, Natalie. Oh, we love you. And by the way, congratulations to Yaya. She is broken down under, and, and I'm so proud of her success. She's 71 pounds down now. Congratulations. I'm so proud of you. The only way is up. I mean, maybe down, down on the scale, but the only way is up. You get what I'm saying. All right, thank you, Dynamite. Lizzie, Liz Golly. I will see you at 8 a.m. I believe in you. Love you, Gloria.